It's Dollar Tree and Regina. The two go together. Let's go in here and see what's going on. All right. Ooh. The buggies are all right here for me. Ooh, it's nice and cool in here. It's been a hot day. Oh, we've seen all of these spider webs. And all of these. Oh, they got a little rotunda here. It's got, um, oh, they have the tiny little, oh, I like that. And I think I have something, oh, I don't know. Yeah, I think I'm going to grab that. just don't know if I want the clear one or not. Here's the pretty candles, the glitter wings. We still got pumpkins. Oh, yeah, we've seen all of these goodies. Oh, I have not seen that. It says home sweet haunted home mine I have not seen that one maybe it's a leftover from a previous year we've seen these have a frightly spooky and enchanted Halloween home sweet haunted home welcome to the fantastic and happy Halloween all right so that's the rotunda here let's take a look at what else we can see I don't think I've seen that one. My favorite color is October. Looks like a little jar with the, with the appliques. Yeah, we've seen that. I just don't remember it because it's been a hot minute. All right, let's go down here and take a look. Oh, look at all the spooky Halloween bags for trick-or-treating. That's awesome. We have signs. Oh, look at this guy with the boo with all the ghosts i have not seen that i don't know if that's from this year last year or whatever but it's in my cart now because i really like that dollar 25 yes ma'am all day long i've seen the ink with the cauldron and spooky yeah i've seen the rest of these i don't know how that one's different it was the only one left there's just a nice Happy Halloween sign. I like that. Stop by for a spell. You never know when you're going to find something different. That's just crazy, right? Okay. I thought I had seen it all. So we're going to finish looking down here. Oh, look at these. I've not seen that door hanger for Halloween. It has black balls and green glitter balls. And it has a bat bow tie that's green. I like I do like that. Okay, grabbing that. All right, let's see what we find. We'll go around the corner here. Pumpkin decor kits. Oh, my daughter has a little pumpkin she got today. We went to Carowinds. I wonder if I should get her one of these. I wonder what she would... I don't think she'd like a happy one. I think she'd like something scary, actually. That one looks like a dragon. I don't know. And then here's one that looks scary. Hmm, I'll think about that. And let's keep going around and checking out the rest of the Halloween stuff first. Oh, yeah. We have seen... Oh, there's the buckets up there. They have such cute buckets. And they've got some nice containers for handing out candy. Little plastic buckets. And then... Yo, know, we've seen all of these goodies. Containers. Treat bags. They've got paper bags. And then, of course, here's the party goodies that you that you, you play with, too. Okay, I think I'm going to... Those are things, so... I won't just play fake spiders or just throw a whole bunch of them in her lunchbox. I got some of those. Oh, what are these? What is that? Party favor. What do they do? Do they do anything? I'm going to grab my glasses to look at them a little bit closer. Party favor surprises. Oh, they bounce. They spring. They have a little spring on the back of them. You get how many? Four pieces in a bag. That might be worth it. Alright, let's see what else we've got. Those are the rings I was looking at. See, I was just going to put spiders in her lunchbox as a funny. I'm not sure. Alright, oh, and look. Here's some different pencils. 
And this one's, I don't remember if I bought Halloween pencils or not. These have got bats and, sc and skull. And oh, those have ghosts and eyeballs. Here's this one. Here it is. You get 16 ghosts and pumpkins and eyeballs. I like that. I'm going to grab that too. Um, I don't know if I grabbed any already, but we're going to hang on. And on this side, we got that more hanging decor plastic skeletons I haven't seen those glow-in-the-dark ones that are orange green and white wow I don't think I've seen those that's different and then oh look we got these little little signs beware black cat crossing that's really pretty there's the trick-or-treat one wow those are little nice little decor items all right and yeah there's this more clings and wall borders and tape. There's the eyeballs down there. All right, spiders. Lots of fake spiders. Let's see these little signs. I've seen all of those. Okay. And here's the socks again. So, okay, so we've gone out of Halloween into Thanksgiving and fall decor on this side and there's quite a bit but it looks like we've seen all of this stuff but how cute to see it again and to see if there's anything new and there's halloween kind of on the end down there oh i haven't seen this one this is a different kind pick your poison hmm kind of cute Let's see yep hang on a second we're going to turn around and look over here. We got our fall napkins and all these little um, dishes. The little, look, to me, this is a bread dish, right? I don't know what else you would... I guess you could bake desserts in it, too. And the table covers for Thanksgiving or for fall. And then here's the fall dishes. We've seen all of these guys. Yeah, they're nice. All right. And then on the other side, we have all of the... Halloween guys, right? Let's see. Still got plenty of Halloween decor going on. Look at that. It's just a big old plop of them. But I don't see the mommy one. I'm glad I snagged it because I haven't seen it again. No, there's a white one that's a mummy one and I don't see it in there. Alright, let's keep going. So over here we have the candy lots of it we have more fall don't you seen all these pumpkins there's more of the candy here's I keep thinking about those eyeballs but it's bubble gum so it's gonna be a waste of money I know it's only a dollar but I don't like to waste anything so sorry sorry oh look at this I haven't seen all these bows there's a silver one there's a gold one and there's a purple one and they're three dollars and they have spider webs and spiders on them. Everything looks pretty well stocked up for sure. Wow, look at all these socks. Yeah, I know I'm all about the socks. Wow, that just amazes me. That is 10 pair for $3. And this is men's low cut socks, size 6 to 12. And that's not 10 pair, but maybe it is. Yeah, that's 10 pair right there. Wow for three dollars that's not bad so even if they didn't last you could just toss them and get more so all right we're gonna go down the Dollar Tree Plus now I don't know if I pointed these out but they have the real uh, Disney Mickey and Minnie for five dollars a piece that's really cool licensed stuff there's these are the five or three or five dollar toy items oh wow look at this moon mud I haven't seen that for five bucks. That's different. All right. They have some Play-Doh here for $3. Five different containers if you're into the Play-Doh. Um, oh, and I've seen these before. I really like these. These are the little um, Takumos. They're $3 in different colors, and they are wonderful. They're they're, now, the little faces will rub off pretty quick if you're not gentle with it, you know, and you know how kids are. So... But I really like mine. I post it all the time. Oh, there's a white one. I don't think I got the white one. 
but I had a whole bunch of those when I found them. All right, and back on this side, we got more Halloween decor that we have seen left and right everywhere. I never did get the um, fairy garden stuff, but this would be good for a tiered tray maybe, right? Five bucks. And they have a couple of different ones. So that one's just a fall one. Here's the Halloween one with the skulls. They have a witch one, a ghost one. There's the witch one. And so those are kind of neat. They got all the bleeding candles here that we have seen. The spiders, the candy holders, the spell book guy, skeleton. We got the candy corn, pom-pom garland. Yep, we've seen all of these goodies. They just still have them here. So... If you've not decorated for Halloween and you're still looking for stuff, it is out here. It looks like all of it is out here. And then on this side, we have more um, crafting stuff for um, coming up. Uh, we have the Harmony toilet paper as well. Six giant rolls for $5. I have no idea. Oh, wait, that's not toilet paper. That's paper towels. But they have toilet paper up here. So that's $3. So... Uh, oh, look at this decor here. It's, uh, it looks like books, and it's five bucks, and it says Home Sweet Home, and has a uh, twine around it with the beads. That's kind of cute. Oh. All right, and let's see what else we can. Oh, look. Oh, my Lord. No, they didn't. Christmas has hit. <sighs> yes, sir. This Dollar Tree has got a lot of Christmas stuff out already. Wow, oh my gosh. I don't know if I'm ready. But look, they got the Nomies already. Oh, he's got his foot stuck. Come here, little Momi, can I free you out? I don't wanna do it, cause I don't wanna break him. Oh yeah, he's good and stuck. He has a friend back here though. Hello, little Nomi, you're nice and fat too. He's got little ears, and he is three dollars. He's only three. He's not five, but that's a Christmas elf gnome. And then they have just the regular red one, like that Christmas elf gnome. Wow, they're pretty fat too. Here's a green and red one. Here's a Christmas apron. Oh, I guess it was hung over there and it fell or broke off or something. <laughs> Look at this Nomi with his green hat. Check him out. And here's a plaid one with mistletoe on his hat. And then we have, I don't know if I need all of these. And there's a green one with his toboggan type hat on. Wow, I don't know if I need all of them. But they're all still cute. And here's a gray one over here. Look at him. He looks cold. Oh, come here, little Nomi. Let me see what you look like. Yeah. Oh, they're only $3 a piece, which is not bad. But none of them look like girls. They're all little boys. That's my disappointment. They all look like dudes. So, he's got reindeer ears. <laughs> look at that. He's got reindeer ears. And he's not real Christmassy because he's got this brown outfit on. But he is cute with the green hat and the Chris and the reindeer ears and the red nose. Look at that. And then they have these little head bobbing ones, these little metal tin ones. So this one has a Christmas tree. This one has a present. Let's see if there's a different one back there. No, they're all the same except for this little gold one. And he's got a bell. That's cute. I don't know if I have that one or not. I know I bought some of these, but I can't remember if I bought that one or not. That kind of stinks now, doesn't it? All right. I think I, I think I did with the bell, but I think this one's in better shape, so I'm gonna put him in my cart. I don't think I'm gonna get this guy just because, I mean, I love green, but I don't really like the fact that he's wearing these brown, that brown outfit that he has on. Okay, and then they have, oh, look at the mats. Jingle all the way. And I know I picked up a mat already, so I'll have to go back and see which one I got. And there's a bunch of them there, but because they're up here, I'm not going to be able to go through them. I'd have to pull the whole thing down and go through them. 
But look, they have the Santas over here. They have a gray one. They have a red one. Here is our African American Santa in his red suit. Oh, and then here's the African American Santa in his gray suit. So I have those. They have the oh Poen said a centerpiece. Poen said a berry centerpiece. That's in white. And then this one, kind of frosted looking, and these are each five dollars a piece. Oh, there's the star candle holder, and here is a like a peppermint ball one. And what is this? A fragrance warmer? That's what that looks like. It, it plugs into the wall, it looks like. A fragrance warmer. And that one looks kind of like an elf. Yep, that's kind of a, or a gnome. Here is the fragrance warmer that is the snowman. And there's one here that is the Santa Claus. And then this one is blue and looks like um, snowflakes. And then here's one that's white. And you just put your stuff in the top and you turn it on it's plugged in and it makes things melt so let's see what this is oh look at that that's just, just a decor piece that says deck the halls and has glitter in it it's three dollars looks like they have a lot of those i think that's the only kind of thing they have they have the lanterns you got a right a red and black and the white you have to this little faux poinsettia and greenery on it. And the red has the um, pine cone with the Christmas berries. Those are cool, cute. And then you have the little Christmas trucks. And of course, the standing gnomes down here. We see all the tall ones. There's one back there. Oh, he looks like an elf. Is that not so cute? And there's an angel back there. So there's the Santa. And I wanted to get a good shot of this angel because I think she's just, wow. Oh, already Christmas is gonna be here before we know it. Oh yes, ma'am. We got these wood decors. This one is, it says peace on earth. And then, and then attached to the wood piece is, are these wood houses. And uh, the middle one is a bigger one and it's green and black check. And then on the left you have one that's white. And on the right you have one that's got like a, um, it's, it's neutral colored, but it looks like it has a church window. And it's got two little faux trees on either side. And it's $5 and it says peace on earth. So that's really, really nice. And then behind it they have the same type of thing, except it's red and white buildings. And it's got two trees on either side and it says home for the holidays. And if we go back even more, I'm not going to you know, pull those all down, but I can maybe reach behind. Oh, and this is one I have. These are trees. And there's four trees, and they're attached to this wood piece. They're flat wood pieces, the trees are. One's green, one's silver, one is check, and one is black and white check. And one is, like, plaid. And then you have two different deer on either side, and it says joy to the world. So that's a really nice decor piece. And these are $5 each. Yes, $5 each. And then they also have all of these uh, reindeer, metal reindeers that are $5. Some are kneeling like this. Some are standing with their head tilted upward. And some are looking behind themselves. Some are silver. Some are more of a deep copper color. So that's very interesting, right? We have some stockings for $3 already. Well, that's not bad quality. Ooh, not at all. It says it's a luck stocking. That one's red. We have a gray one. And they have this little um, tassel with a pom-pom on the end of it. Wow. We have a plethora of nutcrackers in all different sizes and shapes and different arrangements. And I know I bought a nutcracker, but I can't remember which one. We have these wood signs. This one is a Santa head. It says, Santa, please stop here. And it's like got um, a little dial that points to the day so you can do a countdown these are five dollars each this one is a snowman and his um, nose is carrot and you turn the nose to the day it is and over here we have days until Christmas and this is a flat square snowman and then we have the reindeer on the end it says jingle all the way his hat has the word jingle in it and it's a little traditional Christmas cap with the white um, tassel on the top and the red uh, and then you have their candy cane nose that you turn to the day. They jingle all the way, and that's five dollars. 
So I don't always see these at Dollar Tree, but they do have the Jot magnifying glass here. It's a three times magnification and it's $1.25. They also have the um, three hole notebook punch, which I don't see at every Dollar Tree. These They have blue, lavender, and pink here. And they also have a three piece of the sharpeners. So these are pencil sharpeners. We could use them for crayons and they come in these lovely colors. And then up here you can get a five piece jot sharpener that comes with four erasers and the sharpener itself. And see it's got two holes. One is for the crayon, one is for the pencil. So those are here. We also have the play coins here so you can teach your kids how to count money. And they have paper clips for $1.25. You get 250 of the regular metal paper clips. And over here you can find 250 pieces of the Jot plastic color at plastic paper clips in different wonderful colors. Um, so and here's a 220 count and these have some white ones and some more primary colors instead of the pastels. They also have push pins in clear and multicolor. They also have the colored pearl push pins up there, 30 pieces for $1.25 and the clear ones for a dollar I mean 120 ones for $1.25. And then these are rose gold push pins, 30 pieces for $1.25. So So on this aisle they have a lot more Christmas stuff. Oh, look at this. They have uh, silver and gold cedar picks. They have the candy cane wreath um, form, or the candy cane form, I should say. And then they have the filler, the vase fillers, and those holiday colors. And they have all the tinsel stems and the mesh tubes in holiday colors. And we have our pom pom crafts. We have a felt ornament kit for a tree, a reindeer, a friendly reindeer. We also have some felt stickers. We got Santa. We got gingerbread man. We got ornament fillers in various different colors from just the traditional red and green to the blue and silver to orange and yellow. How about that? We got stockings that you can paint and color yourself. Here's some foam scatter. Of course, we have tons of the ribbon in the different colors. This is white. We have green and white. We have blue and white all over. Um, and then we have Christmas ribbon. Oh, look at that love Santa and they got the just the narrow one we have the glitter with the solid colors and then we have the wide ribbons and oh look at this it's glitter mesh ribbon in red green silver and gold wow so we are full of glitter and then we have lots of the um, craft the blanks so in different shapes we have of course the um, snowflakes in a couple of different patterns we have the christmas cottage that's blank and it has a couple of different patterns we have the truck with the carrying the tree we have the santa face we have a snowman we have a gnome and we have a gingerbread man down here we have a christmas tree we have a fox and then behind that we have some snowflakes like one giant snowflake we have a star and we have an ornament so those are all here and then up here we have on um the face prop the diy face prop we have a reindeer a snowman and a santa and then we have these ornaments that are a darker neutral color this one is i think you can paint it whatever color you want and there's two different kinds of of snowflakes and then we have the fake snow and we have all the jingle bells <laughs> Um, yeah, we're getting ready. And then here's all the little paint sets. So you can paint um, everything from Christmas trees and Santa to the nativity. There's the nativity. We have a snowman with candy canes. We have a truck. And we have a little gnome, a snowman, and a Santa. And then we have just some little wood shakes. We have stars, snowflakes, gingerbread man, and bells. And then over here we have some just wood shapes those are look like dowels almost just the knobs so you could have them as people or even something else these look like little angels they're wood shapes so you can paint them whatever color you want and then down there are the uh, plastic uh, ornaments that you just open up and fill with whatever you want to put in so they have plenty of those here and on their back wall over here near the halloween stuff they have a lot of 
ornaments that uh, some I've seen and some I've shown a little bit already and they have more and I guess I need to get busy getting with the whole Christmas ornaments thing and there are just a ton of them there are the little skating booties there's red check and there's a black and white check one and it has a little jingle bell on it and has the little greenery in it with the little tiny pine cones so that's a cute thing here's the little elf legs <laughs> so you actually get two a pair of elf legs and they come in different colors there's a lighter green and a darker green we have a pack uh, a bunch of ornaments that are christmas packages you have blue red silver and gold and then you have the drums haven't seen these they're blue red gold and silver and there's 12 in there we of course have ornament hooks you get 300 ornament hooks in a package for a dollar 25 can't really beat that I don't think oh and then we have all the um, little bells that look like snowmen well it's not a bell okay it's just a plastic ornament but it's so cute. It's uh, It's got glitter on the top. And this one's red, mostly. But then we have the snowman who's got the blue cap and scarf on. And he's silver. And we have the um, silver one with the silver cap and the gold scarf. And, of course, here's red. But his body is also red. So we got a couple of different ones of those. And we got different stars. We have red, green, or silver. Oh, that's not a star. That is a snowflake. That's a silver snowflake. We have, oh look at this, the pine cones. You get two. This is a uh, bronze looking pair of pine cones for ornaments. This is a red. And then this is more of that of uh, the bronze looking or copper. And this one is gold. They have some tree toppers here. And these are going to be really lightweight. You got a gold one and a silver one. I like that because they'll, you know, they'll stay on the tree better. And then we have these tubies of uh, balls, right? You get 15 of these decorative Christmas balls per tube, and they have different ones. This one's a pink set. It's pink on one end and silver and gold on the other. And this one's a pink set, but it has glitter on the pink balls. Then you have the traditional, like this is red balls and, and gold balls. They're silver and gold. Over here you have more. Over here you have the matte colored ones. This is red. The whole tube is red. You have a whole tube of silver, a whole tube of a gold. Oh, and there's blue on one end and silver on the other. So, yeah, and then the, and those are the tiny bulbs. But if you go down, there's more that are bigger. And those are um, uh, not pastel. They're pink and silver. They're the more lighter colored ones. But then you have the traditional ones, the green and the red and all that and then oh look at this this is a pack of 16 decorative bells that are red and gold for a dollar 25 and then we have some bigger balls that are silver and glittery and here we have even bigger balls that are wow these are bigger ornaments so that's blue and has swirls all over it that's pretty cool and it's pretty heavy it's not going to break easily so you got gold red silver and blue and they have some pink mixed in and then over here i don't even know how to go through all of these because there's so many ornaments but they have more balls more um, fake snowflakes this one's plastic and it's a white iridescent and then they have a blue iridescent one all right they have pine cones in a bag. Let's see how much this is. There's three ounces of pine cones and they say cinnamon. Oh yeah, if you smell them, they are cinnamon. So that's nice to put around for the smell of it. We have stars. We have reindeer heads in silver, gold, and white. We have reindeers in silver, gold, and white. We have pairs of skis. We have stars. We have trees. We have angel wings. We have different kinds of snowflakes and different kinds of trees like that's a set of two birch trees that are white and then we have just the traditional teardrop shape ornament and the ball shaped ornaments but they have these little pieces of triangular glass on them so they look more interesting and then we have 
snowflake. That feels weird. <gasps> it feels fuzzy. It's a giant snowflake. It's only one and it's a dollar. And I don't know what you want to call this, but it is a Christmas a set of Christmas balls, but they have like white fur on them and those little glass mirrors or little glass gems all over them. So that's something very interesting. And then we have a whole set here. This is 10 piece uh, ornaments, but they're snowflakes. And they, I don't know if they're plastic in there or they feel, yeah, they're plastic. I was gonna say, maybe they're like um, um, stitched or, or you know, woven or something. But no, they're plastic. And then of course we have flowers. We have white flowers, the white poinsettias, red poinsettias, and the wine. And then, oh, look at this. This is like a pink poinsettia right there. I don't see that. And then here we have some Christmas greenery. We have the mistletoe with the faux beads. We have some gold, some silver, and even some green. And oh, here's pine cones. Here's some pine cone picks. Look at that with the berries. Pine cone picks with berries. I really like that. And I think they're going to be popular. And even some of them, I don't know, some of the pine cones have like a red glitter on them. And some, it would seem, do not. Look at that. And then the gold glitter, not red. Sorry. I was walking down, going around the corner, and look, we got the elves hanging out down here, too. Hello, little elf. There's little girl elf with her skirt and little boy elf. We saw a bunch of these yesterday. And oh, here's the Santa. I picked up the, um, the snowman, but I didn't get a Santa because I couldn't find them. And oh, look here. They have these little um, lanterns. I like these. These are white and look like they have snowflakes around them. And this one is red with a reindeer and this one is green with a tree. So these are smaller than the five dollar ones and these are a dollar twenty five but those are really cute and here's the little led tree like stuff like that okay somebody's singing <laughs> okay i couldn't help it they just kind of popped up when i came around the corner all right and on this end we have more crafting stuff with the floral blocks, the little trays that are unfinished. This is a lighthouse that's unfinished. You can put a, tea light, a little um, LED light in the back. Let's take a look on this one. Here's more vases in different shapes. And more floral stuff. Hang on. So this really is the crafting aisle and they are so organized. Look at this. Is this not beautiful? I don't think I've seen a more beautiful craft section anywhere and they have loaded up with different look at the wood bead one right there the wood bead circle star blanks heart blanks oh look at this it looks like a piece of cedar and there's another one you can put a sign on it they have different shapes of the chalkboard pieces this one is octagonal this one is um not an octagonal they don't have eight sides this is a hexagon and then this is looks like a little house Wow, and gosh, this one is a rectangle. Looks like a, it's not a hanging one. It's supposed to be standing. Oh yes, it has a little stand. Look at that. So you could write whatever you want on it and stand it up. And you could finish it any way you want. They have the little craft boxes, the heart, the circle, and the square. They have the little pallets. Look at this, in a couple of different sizes. Wow. Seeing these puck like motion sensors for five dollars, you're supposed to be able to put them in your like your cabinets and your closets. Portable and lightweight requires three AAA batteries, adjustable brightness, so it's just the puck light. Well, I have a little closet and I'm just wondering, it's five dollars. Uh, I don't know, I think I'm waiting to check with the hubby on that. Okay, the store is um, a little bit of disarray, but we're gonna carry on and see what we can find. And I've seen this before. It's the face and neck lifting roller. And I'm finally gonna go ahead and get it because I think that it might be interesting and it might actually help. I don't know, we'll give it a try. It's supposed to at least be a massage and help you relax. So I'm interested in that part of it. So this is very cool. They have all these lip, uh, flavored lip balms. We have Mountain Dew. Charms Blow Pop, Airheads, and this is uh, Cherry Flavor, Laffy Taffy Cherry Flavor, P 
Pepsi, Wild Cherry, Mountain Dew, Gushers, Fruit Gushers. This one's tropical. This is Lucky Charms. Here's the Grape Airheads. Here are Rainbow Nerds, Trix, Fluffy Stuff Cotton Candy, Party Sticks, Cocoa Puff, uh, Mike and Ike, Oreo flavored, Bow Yum, Jolly Rancher, Icebreakers, Twizzlers, there's Swedish Fish back there, uh, Jolly Rancher watermelon flavor, um, this is the Sour Patch Blue Raspberry, um, more Twizzlers, more Swedish Fish, more Oreos, more Jolly Rancher. Check those out. How cool for just something to put in a little gift bag, party bag, or a stocking stuffer for Christmas. And around the corner, oh, excuse me, of course, they have the Swiss Miss chocolate, um, milk chocolate flavored um, hot cocoa mix. And conveniently, they have coffee cups. Look at that. That's a nice size. It's pretty big and it's very heavy and it's white so you could do just about anything this one has like a sweater pattern you can just barely see it, but it's a little raised this one is a taller mug and it has no pattern it's just solid white and then you have more of the just normal size coffee cup it's pretty small actually but it's just plain white so you put whatever you wanted on that they do have the sweater type one in this red as well so kind of Christmassy right it's not a bright red but it is a nice dark deep red so yep we got that going on here hang on so I'm over here in the snack section we always got a peek and they have these new farmers pantry cornbread crisps honey butter 10 gram of whole grains let's take a look 130 calories for one ounce there's two servings in the bag not a lot of sugars little fiber 21 grams of fiber or total, I'm sorry 20 grams of total carbohydrate not fiber proteins too oh that looks, I wonder how good that is honey butter cornbread crisp I don't know I might grab a bag just to do something different so they always have some interesting snacks these are wasabi peas and here are some dry roasted edamame I don't like real edamame so I don't know if I'd like that and then they have these like harvest snaps red baked red lentil snacks tomato and basil and then they have the lightly salted baked green pea snacks now there's my honey roasted pineapple habanero snacks these are delicious and i do like the gardettos these are great but they're bad for my blood sugar raise my blood sugar a lot so do pretzel crisps i do like my pretzels but they also raise my blood sugar so i have to be careful about that but i don't know if you get any real health benefit but you might not be hungry after eating them this one says that crunchy crave with the big time taste. Snacks are super satisfying without being sinful. And their peas are farm picked and milled in house. Fat powered protein in every snap. Bring on the fiber, the flavor, and the feel good. I'm just, wow, okay, interesting. Green peas, canola oil, rice, salt, calcium carbonate, rosemary extract for freshness. Wow. I don't know if I like these, but I'm going to grab them. I mean, why not try something different? I'm now, these are supposed to be like dupes of Girl Scout cookies. Fudge covered graham rounds. They look good. They're oven baked. And I saw a taste test. There's another YouTuber um, who does videos. And she really likes these. You get 180 calories for two cookies. 13 grams of sugar. Uh, do, 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 do. It has high fructose corn syrup in it, of course. So that is a downside. And it's seven servings per container. So for $1.25, if you're going to eat bad cookies, this might be a winner winner chicken dinner. I don't know. Uh, hmm, this says no sugar added natural fruit smoothie from Wana Banana. Wana Bana, not Wana Banana. Wana Bana. No sugar added. Mango passion fruit banana. My question is, how is this preserved? Because it says mango juice, banana puree, passion fruit juice, apple puree, apple juice, antioxidant, and ascorbic acid. It doesn't expire until next year. It's 100 calories for the whole package. Wow. But it is 20 grams of sugar, so I really can't have that. 
but wow that's pretty interesting um, if you're trying to get more fruits into your diet there's strawberry orange banana beet okay so you're trying to get your kids to eat more uh, vegetables this might be a good thing but it's got 17 grams of sugar and it does have potassium but I'm not sure that that's a real health food that is um, some fruit for sure but I wonder about something I keep passing this every time I come let's see how much sugar is in the prune juice 24 grams for eight fluid ounces that's still a lot of sugar that would really not do me too great so all right so let's see if we got new stuff over here in the cold section uh, that looks like the stuff we've been seeing red baron plastic pieces have we seen full-size red barons here for five dollars wow that's not bad there's the tonys we've seen those the french bread ones of course yep 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 we've seen all this stuff that's the three dollars here's the dollar 25 section and we are seeing the same things we usually see yep and let's see do we still have my pickles we have sassy bites right there not the hotties they have the sassies i'm gonna grab some i haven't had these in a hot minute so i'm gonna grab me some all right and look they have milk today that's the shamrock milk and they have some juices those are some big bottles of juice by the way i do not know the quality of these but this is donald duck orange juice let's take a look and since it's a hundred percent orange juice from concentrate so let's take a hot minute and check out the back uh two wow 24 grams of sugar 290 calories per container but it does have all that look calcium 20 milligrams oh for the whole container 50 and 1125 milligrams of potassium and 180 milligrams of vitamin c wow so if you want something sweet and you want to keep away the nasties you know vitamin c is a good way to go right and i don't know how it says no pulp i like mine with pulp but you know for your kiddos this might be a pretty good thing just watch out for the oh look 68 grams for the whole container oh my gosh never mind never mind reverse that strike that i mean if it didn't have quite so much sugar in it that might be a really good thing for kiddos but let's try the apple juice is this any 68 grams of sugar for the apple juice as well so i'm sorry i was hoping that i was on to something good but um that's an awful lot of sugar this little snowman is kind of new i like him it's a it's a, a head of a snowman and he's got on a red checkered cap and this one has on a multi checkered cap and it has little greenery and the red berries and a little pine cone on the front those are very cute i do like them and i don't see like do you get you get one for a dollar 25 but i like the one with the multicolored hat i do like that now let's see what else they got up there they got these cute little um put your own picture in them this looks like a snowman and it's felt and he, the snowman has on and little headphones and uh it's just like two circles of a snowman but he's got a green scarf and he's got a little mistletoe with red beads and you put your child's face right in the middle i like that a lot and there's an elf one of those as well there it looks like an elf and I bet you there's going to be, oh yeah, here it is. There's a Santa one right here with the Santa hat. And the Santa's holding a Christmas candy cane, Christmas candy cane. And you put your child's picture right in the middle and he's, his face is the center of that attention. I really do like that. Daughter's a little old, I guess, for that kind of thing. But I do really like it. And I'm going to put her picture in it, put it on the tree. She has a great smile. So, and here are some, um balls for your tree that are um, from different characters like we have the Care Bears there is Peppa Pig and up here we have more Care Bears and Peppa Pig there's Paul Pat no PJ Masks and there's Thomas the Train and then oh my I want it oh here's more Thomas the Train there's more PJ Masks but behind some of this is the one I want can I just break it because I'm gonna buy it it is um, Rudolph and I really want the Rudolph one and 
it's behind everything else so I'm gonna have to I'm, see I broke the little clip so I could get it that is a cute Rudolph I'd like the red to be a little brighter but I do like the Rudolph so I'm gonna get that so you didn't see me buying Christmas ornaments mm -mm. no I wasn't buying Christmas ornaments in October that wasn't me I oh, know there's video proof right so what am I saying just I'm surprised I haven't jumped on all these um, snowmen that look like little bells but are not bells you get two for a dollar twenty-five there's a set of silver ones here's a set of blue ones oh and they got little polka dots on their hat those are cute oh the face is a little weird on this one no well I guess it depends that one looks a little weird but these are smiling nice and bright and the red ones are way up there I'm so short <laughs> it's almost pathetic that I'm so short but this one has a nice smile and these are not like the most perfect but they are cute I'm gonna get the snowman too I like the um, silver ones I kind of like the blue ones too so, I don't know if I want the blue ones. I want the blue ones. Yeah, because when, when you think of a snowman, you think cold, right? So, blue and cold go together. So, I'm going to get the blue ones. I have a little tree that I do decorate. So, now I have to ask myself, am I going to get a red one? I don't know. I don't think I can even reach the red ones. Hang on. Okay, I worked hard to get these down and then I'm not sure about them because the red is not as bright as I'd like it to be. I don't know. And I don't think red when I think snowman. Nobody will know that I didn't get the whole group of them, right? All right. I am wrapping up. I still really like this guy and I've already gotten it. I really like it a lot. So. Oh, look at that one. It has three LED, like, candles inside. Okay. Yep, yep, that's coming with me. I thought I did see something. I like that with the greenery on it and everything. Um, and here's another one in the back. So, I'll put these in my sunroom. Okay. And I am grabbing one of these cooling facial rollers I've seen them a lot and I got the other little plastic one so I'm gonna go ahead and get this one as well uh, I'm gonna give it a try let's see if it makes a difference so they are crazy with the nails most of the time but I don't always see the uh, fashion nails for your toenails but yeah those are nice and wide for that very reason and then we have all these multicolored ones look at this now you're getting packages this is 12 pieces it says ready to wear but glue is not included and look they're just a bunch of different colors so I'm still kind of an old school mine are the same color all the time but they also have look this is 80 pieces of artificial nails look at that so if you're doing your own nail business this is um, $1.25 that's awesome or if you just don't want to um, spend the extra money and want to do it yourself, there you go. Look at these. Coffin shape. They're lavender and white though with swirls. And here's some more lavender white. These are called stiletto nails because they go to a point. And then we have the extra long stiletto nails in this dark blue color. Oh, and I've not seen this. Now this is new. Okay, if I can get it off the, the hook to look at it. Nail art tools. Oh, look at that three pieces from sassy and chic you can create dots flowers and other designs wow that's pretty neat there's a couple brushes and then that one's got a special little head on it and that's the advertisement for it right there that's what it does i've not seen this here before and then up here there's this one nail art tools look at that so it's, it's brushes and you can create thin striping patterns you can create an ombre, ombre effect, ombre effect. Look at there. Look at that. That is super cool. So I have not seen those here for a dollar twenty-five. That's pretty amazing. I've also not seen this. I was walking away and I turned and looked, and it's a gel polish remover tool from Sassy and Chic for a dollar twenty-five. All these glow in the dark. Glows in black light. Glow in the dark. So some glow in black light and some glow in the dark and they're different colors. These are pink, that's a 
a pale pink and a darker pink. This is a white and brown stripe. Oh, and then here's some glow in the dark nail polish. We've seen these before. Well, thank you as always for coming with me. Have a good day. Subscribe, share, like. Take care.